Okay, so this is going to be a real quick uh, tutorial on how to uh, burn Snow Leopard to an external drive for installation. Uh, it's really easy. Uh, just go up here to uh, Finder, and you're going to type in Disk Utility. Um, you should find it really quickly. And just click on that. Uh, pull it up. Uh, you're going to take your uh, flash drive or external drive, whatever you're using. Uh, you're going to locate it over here on the left. Um, right here, if it's named, is where you'll see it, but you want to collect uh, or select uh, what's right above it here. Uh, you'll click Erase under Format. You're going to change that to Mac OS Extended Journal, uh, which will be the first option up there, and then hit Erase. Uh, now, just depending on the size of your drive, uh, this might take a little bit. On uh, my 8 gig drive, uh, it's pretty quick. Uh, now, this is saying that an error has occurred uh, only because um, I, I currently have mine uh, already mountable. Now, um, you'll select then your your flash drive again uh, at its root here at the top after it's uh, formatted. And uh, you're going to go to Restore, uh, which is the last tab there. Uh, you're going to select your, um, your .dmg file of Snow Leopard and uh, drag it over to where it says source and just drop it there. Now I'm using Firefox just because I already deleted my download of uh, Snow Leopard. It's already installed. Uh, in destination here, uh, you're going to click and drag your flash drive right there. And then once that's all done, um, then you just hit restore. Uh, wait for it to finish. It's a pretty big file. Uh, for me, I think it took somewhere from like 30 to 45 minutes. Uh, but after that's done, uh, all you have to do is reboot your computer uh, with the external drive or flash drive plugged in. Uh, you reboot it, and as soon as the white screen comes up, you need to hold down your option key and just hold it down until you see two options uh, to select uh, to boot. One will show the Apple hard drive, and the other will show your flash drive. Just click your flash drive, and then uh, that's it. All you have to do is just uh, follow the prompts to install. And it takes about uh, 45 minutes. Um, so if you have any other questions, let me know.